This is the tree mug. One and all, it does a lot of stuff. In the era of COVID, the whole thing is like a nightmare. Most of us already taking it all out. Can see eye to eye with medical assistant Debbie Maxwell. I'm like, some days I feel like I'm in the twilight zone. Rather than focus on the pandemic's tight squeeze, every day the Milwaukee native firmly steps into her reality. I've always wanted to help people in one way or another. The veteran and medical professional is so heading in the direction to save lives. Have you had any persistent cough, shortness of breath, flu-like symptoms, or throat or fever? No. Have you been asked by a health care provider to be self-quarantined? No. Thank you. Have a good day. To work directly with these donors is amazing. From the onset of the coronavirus outbreak, Maxwell's exclusive job is to collect plasma donations from people like Victor and Paula Prouty. My husband had full-blown COVID-19, and so after he recovered, we were hearing the news about how you can donate plasma for the antibodies, so that's what we did. Just open it up. All right, sweetheart, you are on your way. The Regional Blood Center is part of a study led by the Mayo Clinic into the use of convalescent plasma. Already taking it all out, put it through the centrifuge, and it's separating it. Recent research shows plasma transfusions benefited almost three quarters of COVID-19 patients who received them. This plasma is directly saving somebody's loved one. Because COVID-19 hospitalizations across Texas are on the rise, demand for plasma increased tenfold. Today is really busy. I think we have like 14 scheduled. Yesterday we had like maybe nine. At the beginning of June, area hospitals requested five orders per day. A month later in July, Hospitals need 50 orders per day. Hopefully we'll help somebody out. Okay, Paula, that's that first return. Maxwell and others inside the mobile unit hustled to fill new orders. There's back orders too. Because of the recent spike, several orders went unfilled during the last weekend of June. We're going to just keep the plasma. We're going to return back to you your red cells and your platelets. The senior so donor care point specialist point pushes point through the stress the brought on by the pandemic. Rather, she celebrates her role for the greater common good. I've been a medical assistant since 1990, but like I said, I've been doing blood banking 21 years. You think you made the right choice? I know I did. I know I did because I'm helping somebody help somebody else. 